We are seeking monetary damages for the wrongful death of Brian, and we are seeking a court order requiring Sheriff Doolin to immediately make changes to make sure that this type of thing never happens again. We have alleged that the Hardeman County Jail engaged in unconstitutional practices in July of 2018, and we're concerned that they have continued to engage in those practices to this very day. Brian Lawler's death should never have happened and would not have happened but for these constitutional violations. We went there basically um, with the intention of bailing Brian out. And after meeting with Sheriff Doolin and him bringing Brian in, in to the meeting with us, um, he convinced us that that Brian had a problem and that they would help him deal with it. And if we left him there, uh, I'll never forget his exact words. He looked me right in the eyes and said, I can promise you this, I'll keep personally keep an eye out on Brian. Uh, we'll take care of Brian. And the last thing he said was, here, Brian will be safe. I'm just, I was in shock and I'm just staring at Brian's body. And I took a picture of Brian and I, I texted it to Sheriff Doolin. And I said, remember when you told me that Brian would be safe? I believed you. And I sent him that. Did he ever respond to that? He sent, he sent back a four word response. He said, I'm sorry for your loss. We're a grieving family and we're sticking together, trying to help each one get through each day. And if we can prevent another family from going through what we have gone through for the past year, that's what we would like to see happen. This shouldn't have happened.